What's happening, folks? And welcome to a new 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 series this year of Stars of Tomorrow. If you're an old school viewer to my channel, you will know how this series works. If you're a new viewer to my channel, I will explain it to you. But first of all, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, keep up to the other content on Foot Manager on here. Down below are links to my second channel, which is mainly my non non football related gaming channel, and also my FIFA channel, EA Sports. I see down below. So do all kinds of separate and different channels. So if you like FIFA. It's down below. I'll put I'll call it I'll call it FIFA channel, or EA Sport, EA EFC channel. And um, if you want to see people getting non games that are non football related, the channel's on there for that as well. So those of you who've been following this channel for the last few weeks will know they've had a lot of problems with the PC recently. I've got a gaming laptop and recording on this at the moment. Um, so I do apologise if I I can't I can record 3D on here. It's not ideal. Uh, it's not powerful, not overly powerful, but it's enough to play 2D manager and record and edit stuff. So I can do some content even if the PC gets taken away um, for any kind of damage uh, issues. So content should not be disrupted. I need to do some more tests on like can I record um, console footage on here? Because if I can record all on here, then we're golden for content. I can keep recording content, but I'll also let you know if I'm recording on laptop or the PC. PC can be more powerful. So this series today is a series that I do every year where we look at young players on Football Manager and we see how they get on the course of their careers. And we look in, in depth and everything, look at their obviously stats on the obvious things, the technical, mental, and physical stats. We look at their injury record, look at their goals and assists record, especially for forwards. We do a scout report on them. We try and negotiate a fee for them if we can, depending on the contracts that contract status and all that stuff and look at it in as well and give my opinion on them so today's player is and again one thing you know about it so guys i can never pronounce players names correctly is eli why he i'm probably saying name completely wrong um but we're going with it young striker if you're playing fifa e efc you know how good this guy is on career mode um, but it's a player i've not been made aware of until recently um on foot manager so i thought we'd have a look at see how he gets on here so now, I've done a scout report for you guys. Now, just, 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 just let you guys know, just for the sake of consistency, I will do Man United every single time, just so it's consistent every time we do it. Obviously, different scouts give different opinions, but, you know, we'll, we'll do a scout report on them. So, obviously, he signed a new contract um, in 2023, so recently, so we can't actually sign him in the first window. Um, but he got two and a half star current ability, uh, three star potential, maybe five, four star potential. Uh, he's got a max potential rating which is locked to 164 so there's no variation in that in your save so every time you start a save this guy will start with that potential rating so the pro is obviously great pace we saw that can play a couple of positions very excellent performer very adaptable when it comes to playing in the country and is very ambitious in nature and the and the negative sides to him not too bad really um obviously needs the language does look for the scouting from an english club Development wise, as you can see here, yes, he's, he's very weak on his left foot, but very strong on his right foot. So, obviously, the right hand side of playing center forward is probably not going to be a good idea. But, poacher, um, advanced forward, uh, complete forward, pressing forward, you know, striker is what he mainly is. And left wing, sure, inside forward, you can play in there as well. So, look at the main stats as you can see on the screen here. We've got 16 finishing and 16 pace that stand out straight away. Uh, I need to get that straight to his height 184. I'm not sure how, I'm not sure how much it is in, in foot. Uh, and inches, I'm not great at my conversions, but again, great pace, good technique, um, good composure. The triangle of finishing, I like to call that finishing, composure, and technique are all good for an eight for a 20 year old striker. Next to him, over eight kicks, obviously, not necessarily going to be able to be cast in first season anyway, he's just having Montpellier, but. 25 million pounds of a lot of money and no one's clause in his contract. Again, we look at his kind of thing as well every time we go for a jump. So, speaking of which, um, first jump, let's hit it. Hey folks, so he's still in League 1 with Lon. Um, the valuation now to 30 million to 91 million pounds and the main stats have increased are basically what we saw earlier. He's finishing up to 17, put 16, pays 17 and as I'm doing this, this laptop is Wailing away in the background with the fans, but I think it's because I'm recording, it's not the most powerful laptop, it's working hard to get recorded. This is why I need to check something around because I'm doing my two screen thing. So I'll check how it's doing. It's not looking at his frames, this is working very hard, so I can do it, but it's not ideal, of course. 
Um, so 17 finishing, good bow, yoga, good pace. Um, strength is good, stamina is good, good acceleration, agility, and balance. Um, basically, that's a, basically the same, same after, other than that. We've got player traits of places, shots, leg speed, offside trap, tip over kicks, and cut inside from left wing. Lean to what I said at the start of the review that this guy is mainly going to be a striker, but can play left wing as well, inside forward. They're playing a striker in the current position that he's playing in. Career stats, let's have a look. So, first season in Lon, he got 23 goals. One assist, and it's pretty good for him. Then, second season, he got 16 goals total in 41 appearances. Then, he got 13 in 23, and then he got 16 in 33. Injury records, have a look here. One injury there in 2026 for two months. He's been injury in training, but overall, on that, nothing there really concerning me in terms of actual injuries that could be a problem overall. So, overall, really good striker, really solid in league on, uh, scoring lots of goals, double figures every season. There's no risk closing his contract. Again, I show this anyway, just make sure, just in case it's, it's, it's potentially they could do it. There's no guarantee, of course, they may still do it, even if, even if they don't do it in this save, they might do it in yours. Every save is different, as Miles famously said in a Q&A section. Um, also, we didn't do a negotiation or transfer fee, because no point, because it's a new contract. We will do that in future, future reviews on players when we get a chance to negotiate a fee to see if we can get it down uh, on what kind of fee you can get. It won't be an in-depth negotiation in depth negotiation it'll be a very quick one just to give you an idea of what you can get and obviously if you work harder at it make it a bit better deal than what I will do in the limit time I give myself to do it on here so yeah 24 years old he can score goals in League 2 League 1 sorry let's see, that, let's see if that continues so he's still in League 1 um, he's scoring goals still because he's got a goal in every goal every other game according to that 20, 221 appearances 110 goals that's about a goal of a, of a game, if not bang on. Uh, again, stats then relatively the same. Again, his match potential rating was, has he got to that yet? He's not, he's 10 off right. So again, you know, 164 is max he can get to. There is a ceiling there that he can hit. Currently, players, currently players interested in him are uh, Bournemouth, interested in signing him. Um, yeah, but again, I think he's better than Bournemouth. I think he can go to a like, top. 10 Premier League club. Imagine Bournemouth could be very good in this save, for example. It's, it's three years on. Again, those are the same stats across the, across, the, across, the, across, the back, across the area here. And again, nothing. I mean, a couple of injuries there, extra for two months. Um, so that is maybe it's unlucky. Um, but we'll see. Obviously, if it's different, of course. So 16 goals in 33 appearances then. Then they got 14 in 28, 11 in 23, 21 in 41, and then 15 in 28. So he gets. Relatively 15 goals each a season. Maybe occasionally gets a bit higher than that on, the, on, a, on a good season. But Lon, you've got to bear in mind them. Can we see where they finished in the table this season? So Lon finished in the bottom half. And what did he get this season for them? 15 goals. So, you know, it ain't terrible, is it? Let's be honest. Contract talk here. Contract information here. There's still no risk clause in there. At least not in this occasion. There might be one. Previously, they negotiated it. I don't know, but I don't see. The, I don't see. Um, I, I'm, I think they'd probably smart to put one in there. So I think the big clubs will come and stuff up at a later, a later point. Um, can play right wing now a bit more, but again, that weak foot, left foot is a problem. But if you want to use him as a, as a winger, you could do. The crossing is not great though, so I wouldn't. I'd say only play him there if you need to. But again. Good, good strength, good stamina, good pace, good acceleration, good agility, good composure, good vision, um, composure, and technique. Looking not as high as I like to be in my teams, but again, there's too many, there's so many plus sides. I think you can negate that. So let's see if he moves clubs and then see if he can do it in another league because I think he will get bought at some point by somebody. Bomb of looking around at him right now. Let's see if they buy him or someone else does. I was right, but not the club. He's gone to. Um, Aston Villa, AC Milan. I'm thinking that off because United play them next Sunday on my brain. So yeah, again, uh, big, the, the big increase here is obviously the first touch. Obviously, pace going down a little bit in service, but he's now 32 years old. That's understandable. A quick check at the injury record again. But apart from that, two month injury in 2030, it's been relatively okay, more or less. Um, how much did they pay for him? 72 million pounds, a lot of money for him. Um, but then you get 21 goals. Then then you got 15. Then 15 again and 10 moved mid season to AC Milan and got nine in seven. And then he got 28 in 43 and then 16 in 39. So he just get lots of goals and he didn't in Serie A and League Gun. Um, so you can't fight with it. I think this is a guy you get early on. 
the plus side of this guy is good pace and a great eye for goal. Downside to him is, is yeah, he has got a ceiling of 164 of potential rating. Um, and he didn't quite reach that, and this is it's now. But again, I always say the game can't compensate for your ability to manage a player. So bear that in mind when you look at these reviews. That this is a simulated version of a player. Uh, I will always set the player to the highest potential rating as well, regardless of what it is. So if it's 190, I'll set it to that fix it so it's locked to that setting um i always try to show the best version of the player it can be but obviously if I say it's different you might get you might you might sign you might you might get a player at 190 potential it breaks his leg in the in the first week of the game and you can't play him uh or can't buy him for a year and then he's you know so it depends on, it depends on how your save goes but yeah so i like this guy um i think very limited in terms of uh, potential growth but what he does have great vision composure technique and pace i think for striker he's brilliant and he can play left wing as well um so your thoughts down below guys on the player if you've got a player you want me to look at leave his name and as much info as you can down below in the comment section and that's basically player name club position age all that stuff as much info as you can so i can find especially if players got similar kind of surnames to other people help narrow them down can't guarantee you i'll do them um quickly i'll look at them obviously if they will develop i'll let you know in the comments i will reply to your comments when I get an update on what's going on. So yeah, if you have enjoyed the episode, I hope you have hit the like button down below and subscribe to Daily FM content as well. I do apologize like the content, but we are taking steps to mitigate that within with the gaming laptop we have right here next to me, which you can't see. Um, but also the PC is coming back and apparently it's all okay. So fingers crossed. But and if we do lose the PC again, we have to go back for a, a repair or refund if it fault fails again. Gaming laptop next to me, do some basic recording on it. So we've got something to record. So Thanks for watching. See you next time.